Hello, it's Natasha with www.soldbynat.com and I'm bringing you an impromptu video today. Um, I just spoke to a couple of my clients, um, closed not too long ago, and just checking on them, seeing how everything is going, how they're getting situated, and the wife isn't doing too well. She's actually down in spirits, um, you know, she's kind of, you know, second guessing herself, and reason being, um, you know, things just haven't worked out according to her plan. Um, everything changed. I mean, literally, everything changed with her move. She relocated states, her family dynamic changed, her work dynamic changed. Every aspect of her life, everything that she knew as normal, um, changed. Uh, and honestly, that is to be expected, especially when you're doing a really, really big move. And everything in your life that you're used to being in routine is now changed and you have to get or she has to get used to a new normal once she gets situated I've done um, a couple of big moves I remember when I moved to Georgia same thing things just didn't go according to plan and it's nothing to do with the state or you know where you're moving to it's really life it is that thing called life outside of you know the house loving the house that you're you're getting um, loving the new place that you know getting a, a change of scenery that's great we still have that thing called life that has to go on and it's, it's an adjustment period so I was really glad that I got to talk to her give her some encouragement I mean you know she's appreciated me calling was glad you know to hear from me and it's gonna pass. This too will pass. It's gonna pass. Things are going to get better. But the reason for this video is that I want you to know if you are thinking of making a move, um, really whether you're making a move or if you're doing anything that is going to shift what you're accustomed to, this video is for you. Whether that be going to school, um, getting a new job, you know, changing careers, um, setting out to write a book, um, starting a business, anything that is new for you, this tip is for you. And the tip is, I want you to go ahead and write down your whys. Why are you embarking on this new journey? Why are you going back to school? Why are you going to start this business? Write down those whys. And it's going to be very important for you to do that because you may be doing it and like, well, why do I need to do this? I really don't need to do it. It's not so much going to benefit you now, but later on down the line. When you meet those bumps in the road, when those hiccups come, I want you to look back on those whys. They're going to serve as a reminder. You know, when you get to that place, things are uncomfortable. They're not going how you planned natural human reaction is to go back to what we used to oh well maybe I shouldn't have or maybe I should have stayed in that job or maybe I you know I shouldn't have in fear but I want you to push past that fear and writing down your whys and being able to go back to those whys and why it was so important for you is going to help you through that period because trust me this too will pass anything worth having is worth working towards um, you know it's worth fighting for you know your plan is to get from A to Z exactly how you worked out in your mind that's not how life goes we all know there's a higher purpose a higher plan um, it may not feel good when you're going through it but you will get through it and when you get through it you're gonna learn a lesson and you're gonna be even stronger than you were before so that is my message to you um, not a hundred percent real estate related but hey outside of real estate I live a life <laughs> and I've been through experiences and I hope that you got something from that you have a wonderful and a blessed day and of course if you have any questions if you want to you know comment on this video I'd love it um, but feel free to contact me my contact information will be at the end and you have a blessed day